Namaste, I'm Prajal Manshakya. I'm the director of both the gallery and the curator for this exhibition, Compassion Through Taras. Uh, the Tara exhibition is going to start from October 10th and it's going to go on for the next three months. The reason why we, have, uh, we are having it for, that, uh, for three months is because we really want people to come and experience the curation that we have done. The way we have set up everything, the paintings, the power paintings, the statues, and um, to see uh, Taras and their compassion, their healing abilities, and get that uh, positiveness. Um, the other reason why we have kept it for the three months is because we want people to come uh, with appointments so that they can really spend time and uh, enjoy the exhibition and also if you know if you are interested come and meditate so that you can get all that energy all that positive energy from the paintings and the statues that we have uh, in the exhibition uh, the Tara exhibition uh, how did he uh, come up with it well my father um, passed away last year uh, and he was sick for nine days so in those nine days what we really did was uh, I, I only knew that the only mantra that I knew was the Tara Mandala uh, man, uh, mantra, which is Om Tara Tu Tara Tu Swaha, which I recited I don't know how many times. Um, my uncles, my you know friends, uh, the artist uh, community really went to you know monasteries to do uh, rituals from him for him, and um, the first place we always went was the Tara monasteries, be it the Golden Temple, be it the temple in Itumbahal, or other you know local uh, temples that have. Tara, Taras. So everybody would go to Tara's uh, monastery to really worship so that he could get healed. Um, unfortunately, my father didn't make it, but I know uh, for a fact that he, might, he did not suffer much because might be with all that kind of energy, um, positive energy that, you know, all the rituals that we did, all the mantra chantings that we did for him really helped him. And uh, not just him, but I think for us also it was helpful uh, to... Um, really move on uh, we uh, for the next 13 months the, uh, we uh, would really recite all the mantras and Tara ma mantra but that gave us some kind of hope um, some kind of positivity so in that period I kept thinking you know if that was something that really helped me why not do something that would help other people as well so that's why we came up with the Tara exhibition uh, the Tara exhibition is going to be a uh, part of the series of exhibition we are going to do um, uh, after the Tara exhibition, we'll be doing a uh, Corona Maya exhibition uh, as well. So that the whole idea is um, art as healing, um, healing through art. Um, we want art to be used for spiritual uh, spirituality, for healing, for compassion, for the teachings. Um, not just art, not just the fine lines, not just the uh, compositions, but what they really mean. Um, you know, what are they really teaching you? And um, art. In the ancient times, or even before, like you know, they people used to keep it in their homes for their positiveness. You know, they would keep a statue or a pawa so that you know they get good energy in the house. So the whole idea is, please come to the exhibition, enjoy the artwork, get uh, positive energy from all the artworks, all the taras, and the compassion. Um, just enjoy the artwork for you know, a couple of minutes to hours. Um, meditate and when you go home um, feel a sense of positive energy um, you know just let go of everything that's happening around the world around you and just relax so please come to the exhibition um, please enjoy uh, please make an appointment uh, to visit, visit the show because we want very limited people uh, because we want people to be safe uh, and also not, um, enjoy the artwork and spend time uh, with the energy so um, thank you very much, hope to see you.